beautiful soul let us take a look at these money messages for zodiac sign cancerian in the building thanks so much for tuning in and i hope that all is well with you remember that these messages are for your entertainment you may find one or two messages that resonates with you and can help you on your journey in some way shape or farm. Remember that your support on the channel is abundantly appreciated. So continue liking the video, sharing the messages, subscribing to the channel, leaving a comment. Much love to you and I'm sure blessings will return on to you for your goodness and kindness. Thank you. All right, so let us get into this money reading. This is <clears throat> this is actually a love reading, beautiful soul, but it seems to be sprinkled with wealth here, fertility, health, riches you're also getting grace like heavenly attention um shining up on you abundant someone may be pregnant someone could be um you could be highly spiritual and awakened right here i feel like you're making a lot of money you're closing some deals here there's something about a river or you may be making an investment or buying property or owning something here like a land with this river on it and prosperity there's something about you healing your generations or maybe being the first in your family to arrive in this beautiful abundant vibration um like you could be the wealthiest or in your family or the multi-millionaire in your family or you're just very smart you're very royal you wear your crown well your hair is growing or it's about to be growing you're about to find products that you're using in your hair something about essential essential oil you may you may start your own business you may work with children in some way shape or form you are a caregiver you're so high value um you may be getting a ring are you getting a ring something about you being materialistic you're focused you value yourself you know your worth someone is seeing this um of all of these qualities within you that i'm not sure if you may see in yourself sometimes anyhow this person they're making a move toward you they may come with an offer, a proposal. Let's see what your first card is. Seven of Cups. So let's shuffle for the Seven of Cups energy a little bit. So the Seven of Cups is um, options. Here you got a lot of options and there's a lot of love surrounding you. A lot to be thankful for. A lot of love in your life. Um, you are very high, highly appreciated. I'm feeling that as well. People love you and appreciate you, maybe because you what the service you give or what you bear. All right, um, you're just like something apart. Something is a part of your destiny for you to get good energy, good recognition, so for you to be rich, enlightenment, and impatience in the reverse. There's something coming. Up. Something is coming up that you've been waiting for. You've been um, having faith, holding on. If something was taken from you or you feel like something was missing, you've been holding, waiting for your turn, right? While doing, putting in that work. Yeah, you've been waiting on something here to come in with the three of ones or waiting to hear from someone or waiting for someone to show up. Let's see. Bittersweet. You're going to get what you want. I hear candy or eye candy. Enlightenment. All right. You're going to find some truth here. Impatience. Yeah, something. There's. You've been waiting for some sign. Instincts. Um, judicial. Do judiciary completion. You've been waiting for a cycle to end for you to get what is yours. All right. Perfection. I feel like it is your time. Your time has come around. Release. Yeah, I feel like it is just your time. You've been waiting to hear what your rewards are. Despondent. Renewal. You're going to get... Let's see. I feel like it's good news. Let's see. Someone may be confused. Victim. There's someone that is trying to get into connection with you, but you put up blocks. Or I don't know if you put up blocks. I feel the clouds, the fogginess, the cloudiness where... This person, they may be trying to talk to you, but I'm on the, the moon card. The moon card. There is a moon card. There is, because there is a, and I was about to say, I promise. I saw the instincts card come up earlier with the moon in the background, and I wanted to say, and I was about to say the moon. You could be dealing with a Pisces, because all right, that energy was someone that, you're wondering who someone is, and I was about to say it could be a Pisces with the moon card, right? Um, you're waiting on someone or you're waiting for a sign that part of the message okay so oh i remember you may be you may be 
you there's someone that you may like very much you're wondering if they may feel the same way about you or someone you haven't spoken to in a long time someone that may be long distance or there was some type of a confusion that came in the midst of things there's this person that is still seeing you as the prize all right this person is high value what whatever we call it. like you value this person highly and they respect themselves they're worthy they're they've healed all of these things you know self-worth energy on the deck release i'm fit, like i wonder if you ghosted someone or someone ghosted you two of diamonds or someone i wonder if someone is juggling like you could be delaying because there's this person you like say, say for example you see how i'm going around the corner like that's what's up i'm beating around the bush there's this person that you may you are into this person and i feel like this person has shown you signs like you were waiting for the sign that this person is into you and they've been somehow showing you sign but this person they feel like impatient or triggered to tell you the truth or somehow bothered because they feel like they've been putting out that signal yeah that energy and for you to like catch it for you to come along because it's like you may have given this person your word already in some way to but they can't see over the fence but they expected you so there the, there's an energy of someone that you expected or but it's just i'm feeling like it's you that is not showing up destiny going back to your destiny card it seems like it's you that's not believing in yourself, in your self-worth. It's you that's not showing up because this person, they choose you. This person, they choose you. And then they, they, they throw the rope over the fence and you're not there. You didn't show up. And the person keeps throwing the rope over the fence because you said you would be there. This is a song, right? And you keep yourself away from and i don't think you have another person in it i'm just feeling like you there's something about maybe your healing journey or whatever you're juggling in your life that may delay you so there's this person that is looking for you waiting for you longing for you but they also are feeling to themselves that you are not showing up so i don't really know what this is about exactly six of cups Someone may be tired, like tired of waiting, facade. Someone was tired, Im yeah, impatience. Someone got tired, someone like gave up, enlightenment. I feel like that is the truth. Someone got tired of waiting on, this could be messages with the two of diamonds. So maybe the rope over the fencing is like um, messages back and forth. Instincts, someone, they thought that you were, you had a good thing going on. You were back and forth with each other. And then, I don't know, something happened. Something happened. Wisdom, labor for learning before, before you grow old. Because wisdom is better than silver and gold. So that's the energy. Anywho, I'm getting a six of cups energy. So today is a day to love yourself. Miracle. Things will change. Things will get better in front of your eyes um there's gonna be your growth prosperity in your life today um a, a new like a new opportunity a new leaf on life a new vision a new mindset joy is coming in okay so this person name may show up for real okay let's see oh my gosh uh, for real i don't know how they got through but someone is getting through Someone is arriving. The minute we thought that someone would have given up, they found a way to make it through the wall. So the wall that I'm seeing is this big puffy cloud, right? So I, we thought that someone was giving up. Like, we thought the person that I felt was impatient, I thought that they were giving up. I thought that they were giving up on me. I thought that they were not waiting on me anymore because I couldn't make it. And this person found a way. This person found a, a way through the clouds to get to me and has arrived on my side and is here and i was sit sitting there in feeling a little bit in despair thinking that this person must have given up on me but they are they are here they've never given up on me this is what is happening for you today you're realizing someone has never 
when you thought you stopped hearing from them or you, you thought maybe because you didn't show up on time or you felt like you weren't good enough or you weren't ready, that this person would have, you know, got tired of waiting and moved on. But this person, they never got tired of waiting. They just were there thinking of other strategies. This person, like, this is, they love you. They may be, like, piercing timelines to move toward you in some way. Going, I don't know. This is like a mythology, a fairy tale. This is like a dream coming true. Something that you've been waiting for. Are you hearing me? Don't let... It's something about a disguise. All right, disguising, isolation. You're going to know this person. Maybe they dress up, they disguise themselves, but you're going to know their essence. You're going to find yourself also, and you're finding this person, and this person, they're finding you, North Star Energy. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. Wow, I'm telling you, like, I said it, this person is coming to you with an offer. And I was saying this is about your money, too. And you're going to get back payments for something that was taken from you. I was mentioning that earlier, too. If you feel like something was missing. Some of you, you felt like you or you were late. Yeah, I was saying, like, maybe you felt like you didn't start on time or you've run out of time for something. That is not the case. You're getting everything back. Renewal. I even said that with the renewal card, too. You're getting everything back. You're not running out of time. Release. What is meant for you is for you. Wow. You're, and you've done a lot of work on yourself. Yeah, you're being blessed here. So we have a moon sign. We have strong water energy here. This is your north star, your soulmate. This person has been looking for you. You are the one. Service card, it makes me feel like you are the one. Maybe it's what you do for work self-worth you they just choose you let's continue mm. king of cups this is true love true love real love knight of cups moving toward you strong water energy moon sign pisces strong piscean energy all right this person they really care about you love you they put you up on a pedestal it's like what i was describing earlier all right, this is how they see you. They behold you. In their eyes, you can never do wrong. You're just their royal, beautiful queen or king. This is a new person as well. This is a new feeling, right? This is um healthy, positive love connection. So beautiful and blessed. Like, it's divinely ordered as well. Destiny and fate. <laughs> oh, my child. This love connection is divine. You will love this person. You will give to this person with ease. This person will give to you. It will be a beautiful union. Seven of Swords. Yeah, there were lies told. Um, seven of Swords. The Seven of Swords card. You both are overcoming some past issues from people, moon card, hidden enemies, so on and so forth. I'm telling you, you both are survivors. You both are warriors. You've you've both had people talk about you, lie upon you, ostracize you, um, slice you, all kind of things you've been through with this moon card. You've both had hidden enemies and you came out successful. And then you found each other and you're telling each other stories. And people cannot trick you anymore. Both of you are so smart. You are high vibrational being beings. Both of you are powerful because of what you you you've done some shadow work, healing, you've overcome a lot in your life. Perception. Wow, both of you may be magicians, chemists, alchemists. Yeah, for sure. Perfection, you're alchemists. Look, turning burdens to light. Turning lead to gold. <laughs> Prior. And I was about to say, you speak. There's something that you speak. You speak things into being. Both of you manifested one another. I heard jolly. So, yeah. So that's why you're having breakthroughs. Ten of Swords. Oh my. With the Ten of Swords card, both of you have had um, like work done on you spiritually in some way that you've overcome. And I feel like it has. It, in your family or close to you 
both of you have serious stories that you you talk about you speak your truth you've been down you've been out you may write books you may be a journalist both of you are truth tellers you're not afraid of being warriors of light i'm telling you that's the energy that is why you recognize soul connection within each other it is so beautiful here six of cups and the ace of diamonds when you be all right so it's like when i see you i run out of words to say and and then when i see you my knees get weak it's when i see you it's like a dream come true it's like when i see you i see another version of myself in in human form that is the connection when i see you i see me in another person how can this be that kind of love but you know anywho be careful walk <laughs> tread lightly in this one because you know i'm telling you a superstar connection is coming up for you but i'm gonna leave this here it's gonna feel really 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 nice there's a bit of mystery in it too so there you are about like slowly mysteriously learning about each other you know so it's kind of cool so if you are both into that cool nighttime vibration and i'm feeling like you're, you're gonna get married let's see what's the ace of diamonds what is the ace of diamonds angels spirits guides show me we have this one number four number 13 what is a number 31 why what is this there's a number 12. You're gonna